You got your idea kit in the mail? Fantastic. The first question you might ask is how does this light stand work? Well, the first thing you're going to do is loosen this knob all the way, a lot. And then, ta-da, you have a light stand. Just make sure you tighten it or it's going to collapse. You've got three extensions. It goes up pretty high. So you don't need this metal extension rod that came with your kit, unless you're super tall. Have you ever wanted your own halo? Here you go. I'm going to show you how to set up your ring light. First, you need to unscrew these knobs here. There's two of them. This one here straightens out the connection to the light stand. You're going to have to loosen it quite a bit before you can get on the light stand. If it falls off, no big deal. Just put it back on and tighten it back up. But you're not done yet. You need to add the diffusion filters to soften the light. You have an orange pair and a white pair. You don't need these. What you want to do is match this little hump here on the light with the hump here on the filter. It snaps on easily. When you put the top piece on, they have little ridges, so it's kind of like a puzzle piece. One goes under and one goes on top. Make sure it's snapped in and you're all set. Next, we're going to plug in the electricity. The cord's a little different, but you just slide it in and twist. You need to plug this cord into the distribution box. Make sure you have the US plug. Yours might also come with an overseas version. And then just plug it into the wall. Onward, here's the iPhone adapter. You have two pieces, a ball joint and a clip. You want to use the bushing on the narrow edge of the clip so it forms a C shape, not a U. It just simply twists onto the ball joint. First, I'll show you how to put this on the ring light. You're going to loosen the bottom screw and slide it into the ring light channel. The bottom screw is going to tighten onto the light stand and the top screw is going to go all the way to the top to lock down the ball joint. If you're using a second light stand, you simply unscrew the bottom so that it looks like this. And then it just screws onto your light stand. When you put the phone into the adapter, try not to hit the volume buttons on the side because it's going to kick you out of the app. Make sure to turn off rotation lock so that the phone will be horizontal and right side up. You want your screen facing you. This way you can use the teleprompter like I'm doing now. Get ready to create videos that engage your prospects and helps convert them to clients. All with IdeaKit.